Okay, so there's one Bedwars kit that I haven't really spent much time on, I admit. I kind of neglected it because Sheila kit came out, and it's so much fun. Like, why would you want to use any other kit, honestly? This is like one of the best kits in the game. But you know what? I kind of forgot about this kit. Even though I've been killing them a lot with Sheila, <laughs> I kill these guys all the time with Sheila. You know, I haven't really given him a chance. So today we're going to be going through all of his different abilities because he's a little bit like Pyro in that he's got a very similar upgrade path. And once you max out his hammer, he's got some really cool abilities that he unlocks. So we're going to use Atatunde. And by the end of the video, I will have some kind of idea whether or not he's worth using. Before I begin, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. By the way, make sure you get this kit from completing the event. I know it's a little hard. I don't know if they nerfed it. I don't think they have because from the looks of it, it looks like it's really, really difficult to do. Only 0.2% have ever gotten it. So fingers crossed that they will make this event a lot easier because 0.2% means it's really, really hard to get. Now I play a lot of 30 v 30s in my videos because you get a lot more time. Otherwise we kind of finish the game too fast. This time we're going to go for speed. All right. All right. We got our first upgrade. Let's go and do it. There we go. Now we need seven more. So I already have two. I just need five more. Oh, that guy got yeeted. We just need uh, one more. All right, we got enough. Let's go. Okay, next one's going to be a pretty nice upgrade. Guy was trying to get his upgrade. Let's get a uh, quick upgrade for our damage, though. That way I can kill him a little easier. <laughs> okay, we got four. Man, we need a lot, though. We need uh, 12. I still need seven more, though. Get up here, dude. Oh, that's sad. Oh, that guy just went to the void with Emerald Sword. I want to see the effect. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. All right, all right. Cool down. There we go. We're maxing it out. We got a ton, dude. We got so much right now. We're going to get advanced here. We don't need anything anymore. Oh, we got advanced. Oh, dude, look at this. Oh, dude, it creates like this spinning thing around you. It's passive. Dude, why are they picking Swordmaster? I am so confused. So you can get an Emerald Sword cheaper? Like, dude, oh my gosh. There were so many better options. Was the other team smarter? Oh, they weren't. So on this one, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go after uh, attack damage. Yes, give me crystals. Give me crystals. Do they give me crystals? They do. They do. Okay, we're going to upgrade. We're going to upgrade uh, attack damage for this one. Wait, can I use these? Can I get crystals from these? I can. Dude, that's epic. Okay, I got I got five. I got five. All right, I've got 10. I've got 10. Let's go. Okay, let's get... Uh, we're going to do attack damage again. Now we need 12. Dude, this attack damage is nuts, though. Oh, let's go get some uh, pearls. I don't know if I should increase cooldown speed. I just want to focus on one branch just because it's kind of hard to get it. Because a lot of people just keep breaking beds and stuff. So let's go and get, like, um, let's go and get some pearls. And we can kind of dive in and out, you know? Because I need nine more. It's going to take me a little bit. But now that I know I can farm crypts, that's pretty awesome. Four more, four more. Oh, I got it. Wait, I, got, I need two more. I need two more. That's it. Come on, let's go. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. Let's get it. It is upgraded. It's totally maxed out now, dude. I got strength tier three. All right, so we got this effect. It's called the Arctic Slam. It's hockey F. Let's try it out. Dude, just took that guy out, man. It's a lot of damage. We probably need like attack speed as well, but. <laughs> I just took those guys out. I don't even know what was going on, man. All I know is I do a lot of damage. All right, we need like way faster attack speed though because this is like really slow. Man, it's not even half a second faster. It's like 0 0.05 faster. It's pretty bad. Let me kill this guy real quick. Oh, dude. That guy got worked. That's actually pretty awesome. It's got a long cooldown though. You can see right here, the cooldown's pretty long. It's like, what is it? Tw over 20 seconds. But that range is pretty crazy. All right, let's go in. All right, here we go. Oh, dude, it breaks blocks, too. Oh, my gosh. Dude, that was crazy, though. Either way, I'm just saying, man, it's a lot of damage. It breaks blocks, too, which is pretty nuts to me. Dude, I want to use it on their bed. Let's try it on their bed. We got 14 seconds. Oh, I should upgrade my stuff, too. Here we go. All right, four seconds. Here we go. Dude, look at that. 
All right, I got it. I got it. I got it. That was pretty wild, man. All right, we're going to do it again on him. Ooh. Dude, it does so much damage. Dude, look how much iron I have. That guy just pearl across because he couldn't make a four block jump. Here, we're just going to do this to him. Laters. <laughs> All right. That's pretty cool, though. I really like that slam. That's a, that's a really nice effect. Dude, look at that. That is insane. All right. I'm just going to tell you right now, if you are in any doubt, always get enchantment relics over any other relic in 30v30. It's, it's the best, okay? All right. So in this mode, we're going to try to work on our shield here. We're going to see how the shield works. Oh, man. We got skeletons. Where are the skeletons at? Yeah. Cast some more skeletons. We need them. I only have two right now. All right, we got three. Let's go and upgrade that. Let's get uh we're going to do shield. Hopefully it'll help us. Give us a little extra armor at least. Dude, those guys just got demolished. All right, so we need uh we need seven to upgrade our shield. Yeah, buddy. I can't wait to see what the effect is on this. Man, I was so surprised by the cooldown one. Okay, we got him. We need uh three more, three more, two more. Whoa, where's that guy going? Is the guy got hacking? What the heck? Who is this guy? All right. Okay, we got it. We got it. Let's upgrade. All right, here we go. I'm going to use my um, fireball to get that plunder. But I also need, I need some, uh, I need like nine more. Got him. Oh, dude, he gave me so many M's. That's insane. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, I'm not even fully shielded yet. I've got nine though. Dude, look at this. Look at these M's. Okay, so I'm going to save those. Let's put a couple of these out. Let's put a couple of those out. Let's get a bunch of this. And then uh, let's go stick the rest inside of my chest. Dude, I'm taking all his taking all his diamonds. I got 10 now from that, dude. Oh, he, he just got ripped. Rip. Yeah, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. <laughs> Laters, my friend. Let's see. I got by 12. We're good. We're good. Now I'm going to fully max out my shields. Let's go. Okay. What does this do? Permafrost shield. Oh, dude. What is this about? Man, he only had like a couple M's on him. We need to farm some M's. Oh, he's going to get wrecked. He just got wrecked. Get out of here, dude. <laughs> All right. Let's upgrade this. We're going to increase our damage. Dude, what is my team doing? Gotta love when they get really scared, you know? Dude, what is this pyro doing? Pyro's just, just absolutely destroying them. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> it's just spawn camping him. That's kind of bully, dude. All right, so it's a little unclear on what that does, but let's go ahead and test it on my ult. We're gonna try with the shield first. All right, so we have max shield and we got the permafrost shield ability. So let's try it out. So let's see, I, I don't have any kind of armor on right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit myself. It's 20 and 20. So I'm taking 20 damage off of a wooden sword with no armor. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and use my permafrost here and I'm gonna hit myself. All right, so I'm gonna try this again. I'm gonna go ahead and activate that. I've got four seconds. Let's see if I'm gonna take any tick damage. I think you do. Didn't look like it though. Yeah, it didn't take any damage that time. All right, let's do that. Okay, I'm gonna stay within range. Took 10 damage. Looks like it only does one tick of 10 damage, only if I'm in range. I haven't gotten damage um, every single time, only when I'm really close to the armor. So it's not that like crazy. It's a, basically a free shield. So we did the shield one. Let's go ahead and do the strength one again. Okay, that's maxed out. And you see we got an Arctic Slam. Let's see what kind of damage this does. So for the first attack, I'm gonna use my angle. Let's go ahead and hit F. Boom, so 40, oh. Dude, that just did 90 damage. And on top of that, what kind of blocks can it destroy? Can it destroy obsidian? Let's see if it can destroy obsidian. All right, here we go. Okay, it can't destroy obsidian. Can it destroy ceramic? It shouldn't be able to, but I know it can destroy this. Okay, and it can actually hit things behind walls. Let's test that. All right, here's from my alt angle. Dude, that's crazy. Let's see if it does the same damage for armor. 32, 24. So I still have 29 left. Here is iron armored. 20, 15, and 10. Still a lot of damage. All right, let's see what it can do to diamond armored. 17, 13, and 9. Not not too bad. Not too bad. And it's doing 18 damage to diamond armored. Now, I wonder what what, it, what is that to like diamond sword? So like if I switch this to a diamond sword, 
It's 14. So it does more damage than a diamond sword at this stage. All right. And finally, I'm going to show you this cooldown one. This one's pretty crazy. Give everyone like a crazy amount of health. Okay. There we go. See, you have to hit someone multiple times. Look at it's doing eight damage. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, it ticks up too. It's like Nyx. 23, 23. Dude, that's massive damage actually. The main difficulty with this um, kit is it takes a while for you to be able to get this. All right. Let's see how it is to leather armor. Okay. It's going up to four, five, six. Okay. So it's only six. So yeah, it does get mitigated by armor. See, it's only doing three here. All right, let's see what it does to diamond armor. Only one. Oh, it goes up to two. And then for an emerald armor, it makes it feel like it's more than it is. Yeah, it gets up to two. Either way, like if to like a group of players, imagine a bunch of like, you could just go and spawn camp them, especially if you had like heal. Oh my gosh. Like I would say static and heals with this, insane. But it is kind of a pain to get. Honestly, like having to go and farm those crystals takes so long. Like there's other kits that are a lot better, like Ember. So like I could see this, kit getting a little bit more of a buff i think or at least give them more crystals i don't know how many times i have to hit a player to get like a crystal it seems like it's a little rng right now but yeah i gotta say i'm not really liking this kit i don't think i would use it it's just too slow to scale like it's got a lot of potential right but yeah i just feel like there's a lot better you know kits out there all right so we're gonna go and wrap this round up sorry for breaking your bed yeah it's so easy to break beds honestly in 30 v 30s i just don't do it i don't like doing it and I think a lot of other players don't too. Otherwise, the games would end so much faster, I think. But yeah, I'm not really sure what to think of this kit. I kind of think it's overrated right now. I would probably not rank it better than most kits. If I were to rank it, it'd probably be like a mid-tier. I've never had an issue killing these guys. These are so easy to kill, especially with like Sheila or some of the other kits like Aerie, um, Zephyr. There's like a lot of good kits that could take him out easily. Even like Axolotl Amy, to be honest. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit that like button and smash the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. Also, happy New Year's. First day of 2023. Till next time, peace.